Time for the Bias Sports Report. Breaking news, we're back on air. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know how a team pulls off what the Leafs did last night, but it was one of the greatest things I have ever seen in my entire life. Yeah. yeah. No Leafs, no. No, <laughs> no Leafs, no. Nobody blows a game in record-setting fashion like the Toronto Maple Leafs. It was the first blown three-goal lead in the third in the history of the Stanley Cup playoffs. You know what? I will give credit to Leafs fan. You love your team. You must love your city, too, because you didn't burn it down like some Canadian cities. I don't want to name any names, but uh, Vancouver. Vancouver. I just named a name. The best was when the the Boston feed, uh, the network showing the game in Boston, cut to the Toronto crowd outside the ACC after the Bruins tying goal. Ah, That was good. I like that. I saw it afterwards, but it was funny. I laughed. Round two begins tonight where Matt Cook hopes to finish off Eric Carlson's ACL. But you have four to seven games at least to do that, so no rush. All right. Take, take your time there, Cookie. The Minnesota Vikings unveiled the design to their new $1 billion stadium, and it's got a glass roof. Dum, 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 dum. Hopefully it can hold hundreds of pounds of snow every winter like the Metrodome couldn't. Hey, guys, what was the main problem with the Metro down there towards the end? What was the main issue? Well, the roof caved in. Dum, 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 dum. Because of all the snow. So let's build the roof out of glass this time. That's an idea. Donovan McNabb will sign a one-day contract with the Philadelphia Eagles and retire at the start of the season. Uh Uh-oh. Unless Michael Vick gets hurt again, then, of course, McNabb will probably be starting. Did you hear the Eagles' new coach, Chip Kelly, is getting rid of Fast Food Fridays in Philadelphia? Dum, 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 dum. Yeah, Fast Food Fridays. That's what they do. Not anymore. It's kind of weird that McNabb would choose to come back now that they've gotten rid of Fast Food Fridays. You think he would have stuck around all those years that they had him? Because he's a big boy. Ah! Yep, he likes his chunky soup. Dwayne Wade wore capris to the arena before the Heat Bulls game last night. Uh Uh-oh. You know those pants uh, that don't go all the way down? Girls wear them. Yeah, Caprice. Yeah, it's... What should I do? What should should you do, LeBron? Well, I don't know. Maybe take some money out of that Gucci man bag you got. Just give it to D-Wade so he can pick up some some big boy pants. Big boy pants! Instead of those Capris. Maybe it's a fashion statement. I don't know. It looks like you're wearing pants that are too short for you. And Sunshine Girl Laura has a serious side. Uh Uh-oh. And now that she's been in the paper as a Sunshine Girl, I'm sure people will take her serious from now on. Hey, weren't you in the paper? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't care what you have to say. (laughs) Boom, out of here. That's all I got, 875-1061. Don't worry, Leafs. Next year. Next year.